Hi, this is Sherry Lukey. This is an audio for body image. Always taking full responsibility for your well-being. Taking a nice deep breath in through your nose and out through your mouth. And then doing a body scan from top of head to tip of toe. Looking for any sensations, any noticings when you think about your body image. And starting on the karate chop. Even though I hate the way my body looks, I want to accept myself anyway. Even though I don't want to look at myself in the mirror. And I avoid it as much as I can. I want to find a way to accept myself. Even though I don't like to have photos taken. Because I hate the way I look in them. I deeply and completely want to accept myself. Top of head. I hate the way I look. Eyebrow. I can't accept myself like this. Side of the eye. I avoid mirrors. Under the eye. I avoid pictures. Under the nose. It feels hopeless. Under the chin. It's never going to change. Collarbone. I acknowledge how angry I am at my body. Under the arm. I hate it so much. to the ribs. I can't love or accept myself like this. Onto the wrist. I just want to be open and willing to see this differently. Top of head. Even though I don't think I can. Eyebrow. I want to find a way to change my relationship with my body. Side of the eye. Because right now, I want to divorce my body. Under the eye. But I can't do that even though I want to. Under the nose. It would probably be a good idea. Under the chin. If I could somehow reconcile my relationship with my body. Under the collarbone. How can I when I feel like it has betrayed me? Under the arm. Is that true? Has my body betrayed me? Under the ribs. Or have I betrayed it? Onto the wrist. All I have ever done is hate it. And berate it. Top of the head. Call it names. Highbrow, abuse it. Side of the eye, deprive it. Under the eye. Has it betrayed me or have I betray betrayed it? Under the nose.
I wonder if I could see how hard I have been on it. onto the chin. If I treated a child or animal the way I have treated my body, collarbone, would it be thriving? Under the arm. Would they be happy and healthy? Onto the ribs. Probably not onto the wrist. They would probably be unhappy, unhealthy, and feel hopeless. Top of the head. I create the possibility of reconciling with my body. Eyebrow. Starting a new relationship with it. Out of the eye. Knowing it's done the best that it could under very difficult conditions. Under the eye. Letting go of past failures. under the nose, letting go of how society says I should look, the chin, you take care of what you love, onto the collarbone, creating the possibility of loving my body. Under the arm. Learning to love and accept it exactly where it's at. Onto the ribs. That doesn't mean I don't want to change and get healthy and fit. Onto the wrist. Because I do. Top of the head. I am so open and willing to having a new, healthy relationship with my body. Taking a nice deep breath in through your nose, out through your mouth. I'm sure you enjoyed this audio. Be sure that you are tapping at least twice a day and whenever you feel stressed. If you would like more audios or have specific suggestions for audios you would like, please go to sherrylukey.com so that you can soothe your nervous system and reprogram your subconscious mind. Remember, when you heal the relationship with yourself, everything changes for the better.